So at this point, I spent quite a bit of time going through this frame and just kind of sanding it down with an abrasive pad. Next up, we hit it with some sandable primer. Um, once that's dry, hit it, smooth it down really quickly, uh, and then get our color on there, get it sealed, and keep moving along the car. So I've noticed after the last little while of actually working on this frame that I really love the abrasive wheel. This tool is something that everybody needs if you're going to do any kind of metal work at all. So these wheels are not overly cheap, but they definitely help. Um, while I did use a flap wheel here on this, uh, here and there, I really only used it to kind of get the hard spots to reach with the abrasive wheel. So you're going to just repeat this process over the entire frame. And I'm talking the control arm mounts, uh, the rear end even if you feel like. This goes just about everywhere and needs to be done on just about everything. So once it's knocked down to bare metal and basically light rust, we can come at it with a uh, Exo Rust Primer is what we have here. We'll see we're wiping it down with acetone as well before that just to make sure it's nice. So a Rust-Oleum or Exo Rust Primer is really what you want here. You want something you can, that's kind of a high build that you can sand back down to make it look nice and pretty just like this. And that's really what you're after is a nice sheen, nice gloss, something that you can be really proud of. If you guys like what you're seeing here, be sure to subscribe. Have a good one, and I will see you on the road.